Flu bug already busy in other parts of the world, and some medical experts say that actually could be a sign of a really bad season here. Our Robbie Owens live at Methodist Dallas with what doctors are saying about flu concerns closer to home. Well, Kaylee, doctors here say patients just don't want to believe that they could be wearing shorts and still get the flu. That's exactly what's happening, and it's why doctors here are telling patients and anyone else who will listen to get that flu shot now. Why wait for a problem when you can prevent the problem? Shelly Oliver has very bad memories of a bad brush with the flu. Is that correct? Yes. You're in a lot of pain. You can't sit up for a while. You can't lay down for a while. I will never have that problem again. So she doesn't wait for the temperature to drop to get her vaccine. And good thing, because doctors say the flu virus isn't waiting either. Whether it's 90 degrees out or 60, it's here. Methodist Dallas Medical Director Dr. Robert Simonson says flu cases have already been confirmed in North Texas. And that could be a timely warning for those who think they can manage those aches and pains at home. People say, well, I'm going to sit at home and take Tylenol and aspirin. And they come in with problems with aspirin and Tylenol toxicity. It's a nuisance for most people, but for some people it can be deadly. Dallas County health officials are so focused on prevention that eligible individuals can get the flu shots for free. The best thing is always flu vaccine, cover cough, hand washing. Medical experts say the elderly and anyone with underlying medical conditions should be especially wary. I have rheumatoid arthritis, and so my medication makes me a little more vulnerable to get infections, and also we need the steps that I can take to eliminate any problems. This is great. So Wanda Howell got her shot in August, and if you still haven't, this message is for you. Don't play the odds. Get it, get it now. It's almost free. If you get the flu bad one time, you'll be, take the flu shot from then on. Now, doctors say on average, about 60% of the people who get that flu vaccine will be protected. So if you insist on playing the odds, your best bet is still to get that flu shot. Live at Methodist Dallas in North Oak Cliff, Robbie Owens, CBS 11 News. Robbie, thanks. And with that story,